fly barless setup on the T-Rex 470 LM. Uh, the only difference from this and the, the Super Combo I mentioned earlier, I am running a Spectrum AR7200BX instead of the MicroBeast Pro. Uh, fundamentally, for 99% of the programming, they're identical. This just happened to be what I had sitting on my assembly bench here. Um, I have set, when I go into programming mode, I have updated my BX to have a red light right now to say it is horizontal or upright or vertical or orientation. You can mount uh, the MicroBeast Pro or the AR7200BX either this way or laying flat. Uh, the connectors have to face forward or to the aft. They can't be in the other direction, but the fly this unit can be either mounted on the side or mounted flat on the top or underneath the belly. This is just easier for what I was setting up. What I'm going to now is, is point G, which is your servo centering. Um, you need a swashplate leveler for the 470 or something to account for this larger main shaft than the original uh, T-Rex 450. Um, the 470 collar comes with a spacer that can be used, um, uh, a collar that goes inside for the regular 450, and the 470 runs the larger shaft. This is no different than any other setup on the, on the fly barless. We're going to individually level each servo, and we're looking for the servo arms to be horizontal or very close. There's a great reference point on the back of the helicopter, and I'll see if you can keep this in frame here. There is a white rectangle right here. Got to jump back to point G. I bumped it when I moved the helicopter. I'm going to come back here to point G. When the elevator servo is in the correct place, when I do the first adjustment here, if I bring this down, I'm essentially looking for that servo arm to be in the center, right here, of that window. Once I've got that one set, it's very easy for me to move around and set the remaining servos until the swash plate sits down level. So there I am very close. Uh, I have the side, the, the elevator servo centered in this plastic window. The other servos are very close to looking at 90 degrees. My swash plate leveler is set up. From there I can move on and do the actual uh, alignment of the blades. So I'm going to pause for a second while I bring the camera around and set up the rotor head and we'll go forward from there. We're staying in setup, st setup step G on the MicroBeast Pro or the Spectrum 7200BX.